Are your Windows Plus Tab buttons not working? In this video, you will see how to fix Windows Plus Tab buttons not working. Check your keyboard buttons. The first thing you should check is your keyboard buttons. Either your Windows or Tab button could be faulty. So let's check them. To check the Windows button, press it. If it opens the Start menu, the Windows button is working fine. If the Start menu doesn't open, the Windows button could be faulty. However, some keyboards and laptops come with a dedicated button to disable the Windows key. So you should also check that. This key would usually have a padlock icon and a W letter. On my laptop, it is placed on the Windows key itself. So if I press FM plus Windows key, it will disable the Windows key. If I press it again, it will enable the Windows key. So you should look for such a key and enable it. Now let's check the Tab key. Open Notepad and press the Tab key. If the cursor is moving, the Tab button is working. If it is not, the Tab button is faulty. If your keyboard buttons are clogged with dust, they won't work correctly. So you can use a brush to clean the dust on your keyboard and then try. Update the keyboard driver. If your keyboard driver is outdated or faulty, the buttons won't work correctly. So let's update the keyboard driver. Click on the Start menu and type Device Manager. Open it. Now expand the Keyboard section. Right-click on your keyboard device and select Update Driver. You can search automatically for drivers, and if it can't find any driver, Download the driver from the manufacturer's website and install it manually. Run Keyboard Troubleshooter If updating the driver doesn't help, you can try running the Keyboard Troubleshooter. Click on Start and open Settings. Under the System tab, scroll down and select Troubleshoot. Now click on Other Troubleshooters. Scroll a little and locate Keyboard and click on Run against it. The troubleshooter will look for issues and suggest fixes for the keyboard. Remove keyboard layouts except US QWERTY. If you have multiple keyboard layouts installed on your computer, it's possible that the issue is caused by one of them. In that case, you can try removing all of the keyboard layouts except for the US QWERTY layout. Open Settings. On the left side, click on Time and Language. Then click on Language and Region. Then click on the three dots menu next to the English United States and select Language Options. Now you will see several keyboards here. You need to remove all the keyboards except the US QWERTY. Click on these three dots menu and select Remove. Once you removed all the keyboards, restart your PC and check the Windows Plus Tab button. If the problem is still there, you need to remove the US QWERTY also and re-add it. But to remove the US QWERTY, you need to first add at least one keyboard. Click on Add a Keyboard. Select any keyboard. Now remove the US QWERTY keyboard. After removing it, re-add it. Use on-screen keyboard. If you're still having trouble with your tab key, you can try using the on-screen keyboard. It will allow you to use the Windows Plus tab keys. To invoke the on-screen keyboard, press the Windows Plus Control Plus O button. Uninstall any hockey application. There are some hockey or keyboard macros applications that can interfere with the Windows keyboard shortcuts. If you have any hockey application installed on your computer, Try uninstalling it and see if that fixes the issue. That's it for this video. If you have any questions or suggestions, drop them below and share this useful video with your friends. Like the video and subscribe to the channel. Don't forget to press the bell button to receive alerts for videos on Windows tips and tricks.